Welcome to the final race of Daytona for the IROC Series, the 2005 IROC Season Opener at Daytona. On the pole is Hunter Sleppy, and to the outside is Michael Ferris. Then we got David Hoots, along with Grayson Winokur. Then you got Spanky Ham, uh, Macy Pena, Michael Canto, Mara Pena, Jeff Lewis, Krista Raines, and Jeff Keniston rounding out the field. Your 11 car field for the 2005 season. 10 laps, and this will be it for the Daytona race of the IROC Series. Then we'll be going to Michigan and the other tracks on later. So Hunter Sleppy and Michael Ferris have the front row for the start of the 2005 I rock season at Daytona. As here we go. The pace car makes the left hand turn to pit road. 10 laps of Daytona, the Daytona 100, coming down to the restart zone. And the green flag is in the air. We're racing for the final I rock race at Daytona. Three wide already as they hit the back straightaway. Grayson Winokur peaks low. And will grab the race as they come off of turn number four. Can Winokur lead lap number one? Though is the question. Behind them is Michael Cantone, the six, trying to come up, gets the second place. Grayson Winokur in that four car. Three wide top trying to lead lap number one at Daytona. It does. That four car Grayson Winokur leads lap number one, but it's three wide top as Jeff Lewis. Goes all the way to the bottom in that 16 car as they hit turn number one, getting a big push from the car behind them. And that's the 11 of Jeff Kenson right behind him. Also got Mara Pena in the 03 right behind. Oh, close right there. A big move to the middle lane. That was the 01 spanking hand that went right to the middle and almost right. Wow, that car. Who was that that went all the way to the bottom? Mar or, excuse me, Macy Pena and the 97 all the way to the bottom to get in right behind Mara Pena. The Pena's down low. In the 03, tr and 03 and 97, trying to get a push past the 60 of Jeff Lewis as they come off turn number four. Three by three behind the front three. Up front, Jeff Lewis is leading the Pena as they're side by side. Macy underneath Mara. It looks like Macy will grab that, and that hole will be filled by spanking him that 01 all the way to the bottom. Chris Doreen's is coming in that 15 car. Three wide middle is that 20 car. David Hootsie moves up to the top, it looks like. So it looks like Macy Pena bound for the race lead with Jeff Lewis. And all the way to the bottom goes Spanky Ham. And the 01 to the bottom lane will grab the race lead. And here comes Mara Pena in the 03 right behind. Chris Doreen's is also coming along with Michael Ferris in the 8 car. And to complete lap number 3, it'll be Spanky Ham out front. And now to the bottom lane goes Mara Pena, the 03. Michael Ferris in the 8 car is coming with a big head steam with a big push from Hunter Sleppy. If Ferris moves up though, which he does, it's going to allow Sleppy to get to the bottom lane. Three wide for the second position. Sleppy will grab second. Behind them, Jeff Kenston in third, up to fourth. It's Grayson Winokur coming back. Lead lap number one trying to come back. Hunter Sleppy, the 17. Trying to get by Mara Pena in the 03. Ooh, late move there to turn one. It's not going to work. A big block out of the 03 on Sleppy. Coming back, Grayson Winokur and Michael Canto are pushing four cars, trying to pull away and make it five. As here comes, who is that? Whoa, big move, Michael Canto to the bottom, trying to block David Hoots. And the six left, no help, and that's going to hurt the 20 worse because he'll be stuck on the outside. Everyone else will be able to get down in line. So single file the front, except for the 20 car. Jeff Lewis coming into the battle. Macy Pena, Michael Ferris, 
Jeff Kenson, Spanky Ham, Chris Serene. So now there's some shuffling up front. Grayson Winnaker in the four trying to come to the bottom halfway at Daytona. And up front, it's the 03 Amara Pena trying to keep the lead at Daytona. Winnaker has cleared the pack. If Jeff Lewis can get clear, he can move up. He can't. Winnaker's going to try and help that. They have more help up top. I don't know. Is Jeff Lewis going to be able to stay inside that four car? No, they are three wide for third behind the front two. Grayson Winnaker to second. Mara Pena leads the field, however. And then you got Macy Pena trying to come up to the front. Michael Ferris is also coming back up. That eight car looks awfully strong. Falls back, but comes right back up to the front. Spanky Ham now to the bottom of the 01 car. Grayson Winker tried to move on Mara Pena. It's not going to work. Four to go at Daytona. 01 up in line. Can he help the four Winker get by Pena? Now, no one's been able to make a move in that 03 car. It's a very, very strong car. But now with the 01 lined up with the 4, could happen. Could Spakey Ham push Winnaker? No. 01's going to try and win it for himself. 3 to go at Daytona. This is exactly what Pena wants to see in her rearview mirror. Balance side by side, maybe even 3 wise. David Hoots has a big run. Going to push the 01 past. Michael Canto is coming. Hunter Sleppy coming. Those cars in line, trying to make a move. Everyone making a move, but Spanky Ham. David Hoots made a move. Michael Canton. Whoa, light move. Come Spanky Ham. He cleared the pack. Moves to the inside of Pena. We have a race now. Side by side off turn four. Spanky Ham will grab the spot as they come off turn four. Just two laps of racing to go this time by. Can't get clear yet. Doesn't have a lot of help down low. At the stripes, make him leads. There's just two laps of racing to go at Daytona. Everyone trying to find a lane to go. Still side by side. Three wide now. In the middle goes Michael Canto all the way to the bottom. Jeff Lewis. Now Lewis looks to the inside. Trying to stay beside Spanky as they come down the back straight away. Macy Pena going to try and move to the bottom. Spanky Ham clears the pack, gets down in line. Three by three at Daytona. As they come to the stripe. The white flag this time. Up front, Spanky Ham. Behind is Macy Pena. Gonna make a move. Michael Ferris in the eight's coming. The white flag. Final lap at Daytona. Who gets back in front? Pena and Hammer side by side. Behind is Michael Ferris in the eight. Getting close back there. Three wide, almost four wide. Pushing up the track. Macy gets clear. Ferris looks to the bottom. The 8 has no drafting help, however. Gonna try and stay beside that 97 and have a shot. Down the back straightaway. Into 3 and 4 for the final time. It's Macy Pena up front. Michael Ferris trying everything he can to get up to that 97. Michael Canton on the 6 gonna try and push the other Michael to the win. Off of turn number 4, Macy Pena gets out front. And will win the Daytona 100 for the 2005 IROC season. A big battle for second, but Pena gets it done in the 97 to win. Close for second place, side by side. See, Macy Pena gets it done in the 97. They got Michael Ferris, Michael Cantos, Spanky Ham, Grayson Winnaker, Hunter Sleppy, Jeff Kenston, Mara Pena, David Hoots, Krista Reigns, and Jeff Lewis. Rounding out your 11 car field. A wild race, a wild race to the end. The final two laps. We're definitely the most exciting of the race. Congratulations to Macy Pena on a good victory, well-deserved victory at Daytona. As we look at the points standings, as you can see, uh, Macy Pena did lead a lap. The only lap she led was the last one. She has a 10-point lead over Michael Ferris. Three laps led by Spanky Ham, one by Grayson Lineker. Most laps led was uh, Mara Pena in the 03, and then Jeff Lewis low lap is 10th in points. So there are your point standings, your 11 cars. See, we got one, two, three, four, five people lead this race. 
So a little under half the field led the race. So the next race will be the Michigan 100 at Michigan. See you guys at the Michigan races.